This is a good neighborhood. In Michael Paganetti's Adams County driveway, usually the most exciting thing is his snowblower. I can't think of the last time that something has happened around here. Yes, he has a security camera. <laughs> really to keep an eye on his dog, Sonny. In case another dog is loose in the neighborhood, I can get him in the house right away. But last Saturday. But I think I was probably right about here. My back was to him. Caught on camera during snow blowing, a stranger walking down the street. Let's start the countdown clock. Michael had just moved his truck to plow the fence line, planning to move it back in minutes, while he was still in the driveway. Video shows the thief gets in and takes off in less than 10 seconds. I just walked around here. And then boom, I saw him. It wasn't like I was in the backyard or I was in the house, I was right there. I mean, it was, it was surprising of how brazen uh, the subject was. Adams County Sergeant Adam Sherman says they haven't found the truck or the thief, but this case highlights a larger issue. In the last two years, car thefts in Adams County are up nearly 20%. We have um, multi-jurisdictional task forces where we try to really focus on auto theft, and even with that at our disposal, uh, we're seeing these, these trends. And while this case is not a traditional puffer, someone leaving their car running to warm it up, Michael's car was running and unlocked. Why did you want people to see this video? That's how fast it could happen. I'll never let that happen again. Michael hopes someone will recognize this thief. But until then, this handyman lost $25,000 in tools and supplies, an expensive lesson he hopes others learn from him. And that's not even the cost of a new truck. A big deal for some, especially somebody my age. In Adams County, Jacqueline Allen for Contact Denver 7.